What's going on guys, this is your captain speaking, Mr. Space Monkey, and today I'm bringing you a little Modern Warfare 2 gameplay. Um, I'm using the TAR-21 silenced, it's a pretty fun gun, it's um, it's got a really high rate of fire but it's got a little bit of a uh, recoil to it, but anyways, uh, if you're also, if you're wondering why I'm such a low rank, it's this whole long story with I had to replace my PlayStation a long time ago and the account that I make videos on is actually uh, a new account and I never played uh, Modern Warfare 2 on my new account so I just started recently playing Modern Warfare 2 again I've been having a lot of fun with it. Um, anyways, today I'm bringing you Modern Warfare 2 because I wanted to say uh, goodbye to one of my favorite commentators of all time. He left the YouTube community. Um, I'm sure many of you already know about this. This is about, I'd say, a week late, but I wanted to say goodbye to Hutch. And before I actually start this, I would like to get across that I'm not doing this for views or anything of that sort. I really genuinely just want to say goodbye to one of my favorite commentators of all time. But anyways, uh, also, I'm kind of experimenting with this, uh, you guys just let me know whether you like it or not. I'm putting uh, background music in the uh, video today because I thought, I don't know, I watched some guy's video the other day and uh, he had background music in it and it's not going to be like loud music, it's just going to be like quiet, chill music and um, I don't know, I thought his video was really cool with the music in the background, so I thought I'd give it a shot, see if you guys like it or not, just tell me in the comments whether, you know, you like it or not. But anyways, um, on to Hutch. Now, for those of you who don't, who don't know who Hutch is, um, if you're new to YouTube or you're new to watching game commentaries or anything like that, Hutch was a, uh, was probably one of the first guys uh, to majorly start doing a uh, video game commentary and like do a voiceover over gameplay instead of making machinima which is like making TV or movies with uh, a video game engine but he actually started recording multiplayer gameplay and uh, putting a voiceover over it and that's where you get a commentary from today him and uh, blame truth were really the first guys to start uh, doing uh, just solo uh, video game commentary and you know they really started a trend as you can see with all these people that have YouTube channels now aspiring to you know gain more than 10,000 100,000 subs but anyways another big phenomena that he didn't really start but he was a big part of the movement was um quick scoping you know, Hutch is just an absolutely beastly sniper if you've never seen any of his videos. And I'll actually put a link in the description to the first video of his that I ever watched that just got me hooked. And just you wait, um, if you watch any of his videos, you immediately just become addicted because he's such a good... Like, he doesn't really talk about, like, topics or anything. He kind of just talks about the gameplay. But he's so good at it. And... Yeah, but also he did, like I said before, he started like uh, quickscoping, he was a major part of the beginnings of that, and um, good at it, and you know, all these quickscopers that you see in these lobbies today, um, they all like aspire from Hutch, Hutch was basically the main guy behind all of that. Also on the next thing, as far as why he left his job at Machinima, I'm not really sure. No one's really sure, but I've read, uh, if you've been on his Twitter in the last, you know, few days, past week, uh, he's, he posted one tweet that kind of, you know, meant something. And he said, you know, I tried the life and it wasn't for me. So I guess he had been working at Machinima long enough where he had decided that he wasn't exactly happy there. And I totally understand. It's, you know, shit like that happens. 
But anyways, as far as a replacement, I don't think they're really going to be ever replacing Hutch. But uh, APL Fisher in the recent Machinima videos has been getting a lot of uh, positive feedback from the community because, you know, Cena Anders hasn't been there, you know, to fill in because he's been focusing on his own channel. But anyways, guys, that's about the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, also, goodbye to Hutch. You are one of my favorite commentators of all time, and I really hoped you could see this, but, you know, probably not. Anyways, guys, have a great day. See you later.